day 123. We're walking out of Hanover. Uh, Dartmouth is down here. So this has been a cool town. We stayed at Judy's house. She had a bed, mattress, or a good floor to sleep on. Laundry, shower, all that. Great neighbors. Uh, they forced us to come have beers with them on their porch. Which we didn't want to do, but we had to. <laughs> and uh, enjoyed a restaurant in town, ice cream. Now it's uh, almost 10.45. Hit this grocery store and get back into the woods for half a day. Going to Lincoln next. Start the whites. Oh yeah, we good to go today. couple little climbs in. I got a sweating. Um, yeah, off to a good start. First thing we're going to go up to is Velvet Rocks. Um, a couple little ponds, things here and there. At some point there's a mountain with uh, it's a plane crash site. American Airlines, something from a Quite a few years back. I don't think there's anything left there, but it is the site of a wreck. Um, yeah, just trying to make good time today. Okay, almost up to Velvet Rocks, and they gave us a good taste of, I think, of what's to come. For, you know, as far as steep climbs go. Because, boy, that sucked. Here's me. Wet, you can't tell. But, uh, it was, it made me think a lot of uh, the Jacob's Ladder, which I think was back in North Carolina. Whichever one was, they were digging into the side of the mountain. That must be Velvet Rocks special. Um, we had to cross the road, go up these new new built-in stairway, and then through these uh, certain kind of tall pencil-like trees, and then it was the steepest climb back then that I could recall happening, and uh, we just had one similar. The trail legs are better than they were, so I could do that one, but I did not enjoy it. But we're getting there.
got the crawler. This is Moose Mountain and it is a sweaty climb you can see. Maybe my arms are wet. Boy, there's a good breeze though. Very steep, pretty steep. I would say very steep. There was a very steep one earlier that was short. But this one is a good climb, Moose Mountain. And there's a shelter up there, um, which we're getting close to. We'll be getting to the top of this thing and going over just a hair. Oh, also, once again, four liters of water because there's none in the shelter. So, yeah, New Hampshire, starting strong. Okay, let's chill out for a second. Um, and it's the Moose uh, South uh, Peak, Moose Mountain South Peak. And I think I said earlier about the plane crashed. Uh, I feel like I said American Airlines, but I was looking and it says uh, Eastern Eastern Airlines, Flight 946, um, but that's up there, and uh, yeah, pretty much all cleaned up though, so there's nothing really to see anyway. kind of settle in the climb for a second and then it's gonna get ugly again for about 600 more feet and then we go down and then up a little bump between the south peak and the north peak and that's where the shelter area is uh, about a mile and a half a little climb here At the top of this one, uh, zero moose so far. However, as far as views go, it gets a point. this way let me find out okay it was the one to the left and now to the right go a little down and then a slide up in the middle little nub and we'll be at the shelter but tenting of course Part of me is wondering if I should go around 
or down to the tent side of it, or uh, just go through because there's a bunch of thunder rolling in. Maybe I'll uh, at least swing around the shelter and see if GIX and Beatbox are sitting there or if we're trying to get our tent set up before this rain. Well, let's find out.